now in this final lecture of this section we will discover about number formatting in java so number formatting is a feature by which we will be formatting our numbers according to particular regions countries and everything so also called as local so according to different local we can create we can customize our code and we can able to have the particular representation of the number in all the all the country format so that is possible in java so this is this class belongs to number formatter class number format class belongs to java text package so in that package it is and uh, one more thing about number formatting is that it, it it will not use the new operator to instantiate the number format class instead we will have a get instance method so we can use that method to create the object and then we will format based on local and then finally we can also format based on currencies so that feature is available so we can based on the currency settings of a particular local we can format our number so that is available in java and this is for the theoretical session of number formatting and we will see an example in which we will go through all the number format features and also we will can we will see the class decimal format how we can format decimal numbers also we will see in that example so thank you for watching now let us see the practical for this lesson in this lecture let us discuss about a number format classes program and in this program we are going to have a number format class which will format according to the Dan Denmark standards so Denmark how this formatting of numbers is happening that standard we will follow and here you can see first initially I am declaring a local local object so the local means it will be like a representation of country specific country country's object will be mentioned there so we have DA, DK two parameters I am passing as strings which will represent the particular uh, country and after that I am creating the number format instance so in order to create the number format instance I have to use the static method number format dot get instance and in the get instance method I will supply the particular uh, local which I have created after that I am using the format method to format the particular number according to the local so here I am passing the particular number which I want to pass which I want to format and after that I am printing out the particular string which I am getting as return value so let us see the output of this program so here you can see that the number which is I given was formatted according to the standards of Denmark so here you can see the dot and comma coming in between the number so that's how the standards for the so this is a number formatting instance view program we have seen so let us see another program in which i will explain about currency format now let us see a program based on currency formatting in java so here similar to the last program we will have to create a local object so i will create a local object of particular denmark so like that i am putting and after that i have to create an instance of currency number format instance only i will create uh, but the method we will use is get num currency instance that method we will use and passing in the local like that and after that in the i will use the format method which in which i will supply the particular currency value which i want to format and after that i am printing out the particular currency value now let us see the output of this program so here you can see the output the particular currency has been printed with the particular currency name also is coming here that's how the currency format will work now let us see another program in which i will explain about a decimal format in java now let us see a program based on decimal formatting in java so decimal format is another class which help us to format numbers so here you can see the decimal format class so it will take you have to create a new object of this decimal format in which i am passing in this number notation this is a representation which you want to give for the particular decimal number so this is the syntax for it hash means a number separated by comma put so like this this is the syntax for declaring a decimal format for my 
or after three numbers there should be a comma so like that it will print and now uh, next i have put another decimal format you can use a format method here you can see to format the numbers and now uh, we created another decimal format here down and in this decimal format you can see i have I have created an another decimal format number which is uh, it is having two decimal places only so that's how the syntax for uh, declaring the decimal formats so the hash means a particular number and uh, the point and decimal point we have to provide our commas we, uh, we can provide in the decimal format class let us see the output of this program to see how the decimal format is getting printed here we can see the output which decimal format values are getting printed so that is this is how the i am giving some values but some of them are rounded off also so rounding operation also will happen if you format the numbers and the, thank you for watching this lecture in this lecture we have covered about number formats as well as uh, decimal format also which uh, which is used to format numbers in java so please aware about this feature this feature you don't need to create any classes to do the formatting and all currency formatting and all all the features are available within the java only so it is available in the java.txt package so in that package there are other formatters also and let us summarize this section thank you for watching this lecture we please continue watching the series